Hi, good morning. So it's Wednesday. I thought I'd give a little update. Um, so as you know, I had an interview yesterday. I did a video on pros and cons of Zoom interviews. Um, and then I had my interview like 15 minutes after filming that video. So I was pretty calm going in, pretty confident. Uh, I did all the things that I'd suggested, all the pro tips. Um, and yeah, so uh, I came out of the interview feeling quietly confident that I'd done quite well. And then I was told that I'd receive a call today. Um, yeah, but actually they called me at five o'clock, caught me completely off guard. Uh, I was just sat at home doing homework, mundane stuff, and uh, completely not in work mode whatsoever. And uh, so she was just like, how do you think it went? And I was like, oh, uh, yeah, I think it went pretty well. There's some things I could have answered maybe a bit more polished, but uh, I, I think overall I did quite well, yeah. And she was like, yeah, well, we think you did brilliantly. And I was like, mm. <laughs> stifle the squeal. <laughs> yeah, but I was, I was overjoyed. I, I really was. And uh, the way she came across was really warm, very kind, very excited to have me as part of the team. And, and she made me already feel really invited, really welcomed. And so I'm really excited. Of course, first time going to work will be the first time I meet her, which is so bizarre because usually when you interview for a job, you are interviewing with the people you're going to be working with. And I've, of course, not physically met this person. So maybe that's a pro of interviewing online or I don't know. We'll see. Only time will tell. But uh, yeah, I mean, I'm, I'm really, really happy, really excited for this new adventure. And I mean, there is one con about this job which is it's full time and I already have so many things I'm doing I'm studying at the moment I've got my children I'm running my house I'm a single parent so I don't really have much help but I'm just uh yeah I'm, I'm ready for the challenge and it's always good to have extra hours extra money so yeah I mean it's good it's good it's not a negative thing it's a positive thing I just wasn't yeah I don't know, I I had a feeling I would get the job after that interview. I felt really confident. I felt like I'd answered everything really knowledgeably. And uh, and like I said, you know, I prepared really well for it. I knew the role I was going for really well. I made sure to mention all of the really important policies and, and highlight the, the, the standards that they're most looking for. Um, so yeah, I think it did really well. Um, and then to get the job is just, obviously it's wonderful. Uh, and so, yeah, it's, it's good, it's really good. But of course now I have the very, very awkward conversation of going into work today and explaining to my manager that I have applied for a job, interviewed for it and now got it. So this is gonna be an awkward day for me. Having said that, I mean, I'm on to bigger and better things and you know, as part of this this life, we do evolve, we do we do flourish, hopefully. We we always aim to succeed. And I'm hoping that my manager's gonna be really proud and really happy for me to move on because this is ultimately the better place for me to work. It's it's gonna allow me to flourish and build on my skills and it's gonna allow me to make more money for my family and Hopefully she's going to see that it's going to afford me a lot more opportunities later on in my life and in my career. Um, I'm going to have to kind of convince her that it's a really good thing for her too. Uh, I don't know about that, but we'll see. Um, I also, yeah, so I spoke to another friend yesterday who used to do kind of like streaming, vlogging, that sort of thing. And, uh, and we was talking about like my new idea to start streaming and start doing videos, start talking about my life, giving little pro tips of how I function day to day as a single parent of three kids, working and studying and maintaining everyone in my family during a pandemic. Um, and he was like, this is a really good idea. I think this is really good for you. And then he told me he was also interested in restarting his vlogging, but doing it as a podcast. And I'm so for it. I'm really, really pro helping people where I can. So I said to him, like, anytime he wants, let's collaborate. So I'm quite excited for this new venture too. 
I've just ordered my new microphone, so hopefully the audio is going to be much better than the previous videos that I've posted. Um, so we're going to see how that goes. And um, I've also ordered an outdoor mic so that I can start streaming my walks to work and my outdoor exercises. Um, just to kind of give pro tips on how I'm managing to function with all of those things as well. Um, yeah, so that's that's the idea. That's the goals. That's the plans. Let's hope it all comes to fruition um yeah i'm just trying to keep it short and sweet i don't want to go on too much i don't want to waffle too much um but yeah I, i'm really excited i'm really really proud of myself and i think people should advertise more often that they're proud of their achievements because people want to be modest all the time don't be modest shout from the rooftops tell people just how brilliant you are and how you're smashing at life so yeah, as I seem to have this catchphrase now, roll with it, work with it, and succeed with it, which I seem to be doing. So great. See you all in the next video.